Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to another vlog. So, right now, we are actually in the car, and where are we going, Kayla? We are going to David's Bridal. David's Bridal, and you might be wondering why. And hey, is somebody getting married? Yes. Well, somebody is getting married. No, it's I not wish. Kayla. I'm just showing you. Yeah, I'm actually running her to her friend's bridal fitting. Yes. Um, she has an appointment this morning, and we're actually running late because we had to stop and get gas. And anytime you try to get out the house with all of us, we're always late. Yeah. Um, missing person. Hmm. What did it say? Yeah. I know, just a missing person, and it had like the license plate number and everything. Oh gosh. I wonder who it is. So sad. Mm, that is. Um, on another note, we are headed there now. I'm really and excited. Yes. We're going to be trying on like bridesmaids dresses and obviously she's going to try on wedding dresses. So mm -hmm. it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm going to meet all be. of the other bridesmaids, which I've never met any of these people. I've met like one before. Have you? Okay. Well, yeah, because like we used to, like I knew her from like a long time ago. I haven't seen her since she was like a little, because she's younger than us. Oh. But, well, that'd be um, fun. Yeah. To reconnect. Fun. It will. So we're heading there now. And then me and Oops. Riley and Aiden. I'm are, my shirt. You are. You look so handsome, man. I love it. He got that for Christmas. And we have not worn it yet. I know Kayla pulled it out this morning. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm it was weird. You Aiden pulled it out. To wear it. But yeah. First I she pulled out like pants and a shirt. And I wanted to wear my Adidas one, she had, she was gonna put me on like a shirt, like a kind of play shirt, but then um I said I want to wear my Adidas shirt, and then and then we pulled out my Adidas shirt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you did. So anyway, me and Briley and Aiden are gonna go back home, and we're gonna clean house, right? I'm not, I'm not. Yes. So we're gonna go home, clean house, but I may stop and get us breakfast first. Yay. So yay. Perks for that. Kayla actually brought cereal in the car. Yeah, and I wasn't allowed to eat it. No, cause She's I'm trying, I'm gonna try really hard not to eat in this car. I know, but I didn't have time because to eat breakfast. Because every car we get, I know I have children, but we don't really take that long of trips that people can't wait to eat till they get home. Seriously. Yeah. And if we're on the road for more than like an hour or not even an hour, most of them I try to let everybody eat at home and then if we're taking a long, long trip, we can stop and get out and go in. Yes. It, you know, you have to stretch your legs anyway, so there's no point in eating in the car. I don't know if we're doing like lunch after or if it's just the bridesmaid. I don't know really, I don't know the whole agenda. So Yeah, she's not really. Cool with the flood, know where yeah. I need to be. That's and, right. So. And I'm not there on time because I don't even know how to do that. So. Yeah, she's supposed to be there in one minute and we're about 15 away. Yep. So, <laughs> she won't be too, too late, but... I um, hate she's late, but it's okay. I'm sure it's not gonna be a quick appointment. Especially Probably with not. everyone having to try on stuff. Oh yeah, for sure. So, yeah. We'll so anyway, we're gonna take her, drop her off, and then we're gonna head to get us a breakfast, head home, and get busy cleaning the house. So I'll touch back base with you guys in just a little while. So we have made it to McDonald's. The kids wanted something to eat. And I really wasn't sure where to go this morning. Um I know Kayla, you know, we just dropped her off, so She's gonna be there for a little bit. I'm not really sure how long, and then after I think they're heading for lunch. So I'm gonna go back and pick her up much later, I'm guessing, but we're gonna go grab some food because everybody's hungry. And then the plan is to go home and start cleaning because I really wanna get some real cleaning done today. I know I say that all the time, but most of the time we go home and say we're gonna clean, it's just kinda of straighten up. I really wanna like mop, dust, vacuum, sweep, like bathtubs the whole nine not really in the mood for it not gonna lie kind of don't want to clean house today <laughs> but it needs to be done so that's my plan it's starting to rain want want i knew it was going to rain today but i thought it was going to be much later tonight apparently not so once we get some food and head home i'll open the vlog back up and show you guys what the kids got to eat and get busy cleaning so we are home now and the kids are sitting at the bar eating their lunch. What'd you get, bro? 
fries. Just fries and honey. Oh, it's actually sweet and sour. And what'd you get, baby? I got chicken nuggets, double french fries, sweet tea, toy, and sweet tea. He meant and honey mustard. <laughs> and look, I'm gonna show them what this does. When you do that, it pops up for a full body. It does. And then whenever you wanna like put it back, you just push these tiny arms down, then it comes back. So that makes it actually come out, like the body parts. That's pretty cool, like a little magic trick. So they are going to eat lunch and I'm going to head upstairs to get our videos up for the day. And then when I'm done with that and they're done eating, we're gonna start what, Briley? Cleaning. Cleaning. Yes, cleaning, because we need to get some stuff done because it's already lunchtime. So let's go and get busy. the bathtub who else out there hates cleaning your bathroom bathtubs are the worst I don't mind the counters and all that but I hate cleaning bathtubs so Aiden had actually we bought him these Crayola bathtub crayons they're really fun they're very fun he loves them for sure but I'm gonna be honest with you believe it or not the red is the easiest to come off the yellow the orange I mean most of the other colors they're like hard to get off and it's actually left normally when he plays in the bathtub let me back up normally when he plays in the bathtub as soon as he's done i clean it off but this time he left it up there wanted to keep it up there for a while so i was like whatever no big deal normally it comes off just as easy but today i'm noticing it's leaving a film i'm trying to wipe it you can't really see it but like if you get down and look up see how it's leaving like a film see what i mean so I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna take some soap to it and see if that'll work and then go back with the magic eraser because magic erasers are like great for cleaning bathtubs. Um, and that's pretty much all I use. I don't use a lot of harsh chemicals or anything. So I'm gonna try to go over it with some soap. See if that gets the film off. It did take the color off. So the bathtub actually looks cleaner, but it's leaving a film. Like, and if you look at it just right in the light, you can see the film. It's like, it's just not coming clean. So, I'm sweating too. I am sweating so bad right now. Probably got the wrong clothes on to be cleaning, but anyway. Um, but I don't know if you guys have these. Do they leave film on your bathtub? I mean, most people probably wash them off as soon as the kids are done. And it's leaving this weird film on my shower. So, it's kind of random. But anyway, I just want to ask if anybody else had that issue with these. If you let them sit on the bathtubs, it like leave this really weird film and you can't get it off. So, anyway. Back to cleaning the bathtub. And I think Briley's actually doing hers now. Okay, guys. So, right now we have actually going we're actually going to take a break kayla is finished at the moment so we're going to all load up in the car and go grab her so we're taking a break on cleaning we did accomplish at least straightening the house and clean wise we've got almost two bathrooms completed not quite though i need to go buy another shower curtain liner i think i need two of them because i think the girls need one too so i can replace those i'm gonna get some more magic erasers because mine have about had it and then we're gonna come home and we're gonna finish cleaning the house. So stick around, we're gonna load up and go grab Caleb. Okay guys, so I am back with the family now. They have picked me up and hopefully you can hear me. We are at lunch or, what time is it? Okay, kind of lunch, dinner-ish. I don't know what this meal is, but we're eating. We're at Blaze. And this is what their pizza looks like. It looks so good. Half cheese, half pepperoni. Yeah? So our pizza, mine and mama's, are getting cooked a little extra longer because they're the gluten-free ones. All right, guys, so we are complete with eating. We are done. So that was really good. The pizza was great. The kids even enjoyed it, although they really didn't want pizza. 
I think they wanted something else. But right now, we are actually not home, as you can see. We're still in the car. I came to pick up some little scentsy type, like the little wax bars or whatever they are that you break and put into your scentsy candles. Because there's a scent I'm looking that's like the scent of Kayla's putty that she bought. It smells really good, and I wanted Kayla to smell it to see if she likes it too, because it smells really good to me. It's called, what did I say it was called? Limelight? Mm -hmm. It's called Limelight. Not sure if they have it here. I'm not even sure. I can't remember who makes it. Tyler Candle Company, maybe? Was it Tyler? Taylor. Taylor's? I don't remember. But I think they sell it. So we're going to go in here and see if they got some. And then we're going to head home. But I'll show you guys if I get any, what about? We are home and I'm so glad. Okay, so I wanted to show you the stuff I was talking about, the little wax for the. Um, the wax melts, I guess what they call them. It's Tyler Candle Company. This is what it looks like. And it smells so good. It's very faint. More faint than I remember. So I'm hoping that's kind of what the little, um, see if it'll focus. That's what the little wax blocks look like. They're pretty good size. The only thing is, I'm just concerned the scent's not going to be as strong as I was hoping it was going to be because, I mean, you can definitely smell it through the pack, but it, I, I seem like it was a lot stronger years ago when I used this because it's been years since I've used this one but that's what it is I got that and I also bought me a keychain I wanted a new one and I really wasn't sure what to go with and I always like to take my keys and put them on my you know my wrist whenever I'm shopping so I thought this would be kind of good just like a little bracelet throw it right on my wrist so I got that I did get my liners and I got some magic erasers. So right now we are getting ready to film a YouTube. We're ready to film a YouTube for her. And yes. what are we gonna do? Um, a squishy hide and seek. Squishy hide and seek. So that should be pretty fun. Yes. So we're gonna do that. And then once we're done with that, I'll come back on the vlog, right? Yes. Okay guys, so we are done with Briley's little challenge. That was fun, but it was a lot of work. I mean, because mom was hiding the squishies, and then I had to follow all three of them each round all over the house, up and down the stairs, and watch them find the squishies. To be honest, my head started hurting earlier when we went shopping, and it was just kind of like faint, you know, whatever. I'm thinking, maybe I'm just tired. But as the night's going on, I'm not feeling so hot. And I'm like really hoping it's nothing and it's just I'm tired and I need some rest. Which tomorrow Sunday is her day off so I'm definitely going to rest tomorrow. But it just kind of makes me feel, I don't know, I'm just worried that I'm actually coming down with something. Like my throat's kind of scratchy and I just don't feel that good. So I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I hope it wasn't short because honestly I don't know exactly how many times I picked the camera up today. Um, so hopefully it's not too short. I didn't finish cleaning the house. I did get all the things to clean house. Got my magic erasers, my new curtain liners, and I'm too tired to do it. And like I said, I don't feel that good. So I'm hoping tomorrow is going to be our lazy day, PJ day, which is, I like being in pajamas and cleaning the house, you know. Um, so I might just try to do it tomorrow. And I'm really hoping I wake up in the morning and I feel so much better. Because at the current moment, I feel like I'm coming down with something. Thank you so much, baby. Riley was sweet and went and got me a drink and got her sister a drink. Oh, you can put hers over here, honey. Okay. So, me and Kayla are going to do what we do best, and that's lay in bed and watch movies. And one of our rooms to do what I do best and watch you too and call a friend. Yeah, she's going to call her friend. Bye. Bye. She's going to call her friend and watch YouTube with her friend on the phone. That's kind of what they do, but... Anyway, and Kayla is getting on her pajamas, and then we are going to call it a night. So, Aiden's downstairs with the dad. I think they're in the garage trying to clean it up because if you see our garage, it is a wreck. So, we're trying to clean up and organize the garage because we're trying to make room for all the new stuff that's in there, and we're going to get rid of some old stuff. So, that's kind of what's going on, and that's pretty much it. So... Kayla's gonna come here. We're gonna pick a movie. I'm gonna get in my pajamas and we're gonna watch a movie and just curl up. I really don't feel good. <laughs> oh, I pray it's nothing. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure to hit the thumbs up button. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you're not. And we'll see you guys in the next vlog.